back at the Emirates Old Trafford. Um, how does it feel being back in this changing room? Well, I mean, today feels weird. There's none of the lads are about. They're all um, getting a nice suntan in Sri Lanka. Um, probably actually fielding at this moment in time. So, you know, it's, it's nice to be back, obviously. Um, I do miss being around the lads and stuff. But, you know, that's, I suppose that's part and parcel of, of finishing playing. And looking back to last year, what were your emotions when you did call it a day? Yeah, I mean, probably, you know, this time last year, um, in March, all I was thinking was, you know, I want to get 50 wickets, I want us to win something. And then four months down the line, you know, that's it, it's all over. And, and you know, it, it is, it, when you get time to think about it, it is, it is pretty sad to you. But you've got to be really realistic as well that no matter who you are, what level of sport you play, you know, it's not going to last forever. And now you have finished cricket, what are you up to these days? Um, well, I mean, I've still been coming in helping um, Ashley out, uh, Chappie with the bowlers, but, you know, my main thing is since I finished in August, I um, started working for SJM concerts in, in the music from last September, so I've yeah. just gone straight into that, really, which, is, which has been good because, you know, the transitional period <laughs> um, from playing sport to, you know, going to the real world, so to speak, can be very difficult but you know I've just gone straight into it and it doesn't feel like at the moment it doesn't feel like a normal job. Please. And Carl obviously you're back here for your dinner on the 15th of May, uh, can you just tell us a bit about that? Yeah, um, when I finished last August um, you know speaking to a few people at the club they said there was a possibility that I could maybe have a dinner um, this season um, and thankfully that's you know that's been approved by the, uh, the powers that be um, so that will be taking place on the 15th of May during and after Lancashire's first 2020 game of the season against Leicester. So the tickets that gets you into the point to watch the day and night match versus Leicester. Um, two calls buffet, Andrew Flintoff will be speaking, telling a few stories, a few jokes I presume. Um, there will be an auction. Um, James Walsh out Star Sailor will be playing an acoustic acoustic set and then if anyone still stood up after five hours of drinking there'll be a DJ till um, till the end so yeah looking to be a good night. Great thanks Carl.